Now, here's your pinpoint weather forecast with meteorologist Henry Grom. Now, much of the country has been dealing with severe weather over the past couple of days, and last night we did have that line of showers moving through, but luckily, no severe weather here for the Mid Ohio Valley. But shower activity still seeing around this morning. We're starting to see some improvements here into downtown Marietta as we take a look at the Jane Dill Sky Cam. Just still dealing with that layer of cloud cover and temperatures quite mild this morning. Since seeing those mid 60s across the region, mainly thanks to the rain sticking around and that cloud cover. But over the past few hours, we have been seeing the widespread shower activity start to slowly fade away. Improvements into Athens County, Washington County, but still have some around Parkersburg. This should all completely come to an end by round before 8 o'clock this morning. That severe weather threat also not going to be with us this morning. So 60s across the board right now, warmer off to our East Clarksburg, 69 degrees. So still sticking with those mild temperatures should be in the upper 60s by 9 o'clock, mid to upper 70s by lunchtime with those low 80s still sticking around this afternoon with some sunshine helping out. But that chance of thunderstorms still going to be keeping an eye on that today, but that will be mainly into tonight. Our severe weather threat going to be on the lower end this time around with the marginal threat throughout most of the mid Ohio Valley. All of that severe weather mainly just going to be towards the south around Missouri, Kentucky and Tennessee. So timing out that severe weather threat, no impacts for us for this afternoon. We'll see those rounds of storms mainly staying towards our southwest around Kentucky and Missouri. But for us, a few isolated to scatter thunderstorms will still be around that time frame, mainly around 10 o'clock to around midnight tonight. Then we quiet down. Now the severe weather threat completely over for our Thursday, but we will still see some scattered showers and storms possible throughout parts of tomorrow. So. Still, even though there's that possibility for severe weather, even though it's a lower end, still keep an eye on that. Our main threat going to be damaging winds, but cannot rule out that isolated hail threat, possibly up to quarter size hail. And with the time frame being through tonight, still got to keep an eye on those alerts through the WTAP pinpoint weather app. And with some of those heavier downpours, that flood watch still in effect until 11 a.m. tomorrow morning. So you can still enjoy our afternoon today with temperatures into the 80s tonight on the mild side still lower 60s but cooler air arriving over the next couple of days we'll look at those 70s tomorrow and like i mentioned low 60s overnight tonight that's going to be our daytime high friday and we'll look at those 60s going into mother's day weekend next chance for showers and storms on saturday but right now not expecting any more severe weather. Alexa.